Hey guys, today I'll be doing a quick unboxing video of HyperX Cloud Core Gaming Headset slash headphone that I recently bought. I ordered this from Direct Canada for $51 with taxes, with taxes and etc. It came down to $58. It was shipped to my door in two days, which is pretty damn fast because the shipping was free. I'll post the link in the description below where you can purchase it from. I must say right off the bat, my first impression on this headset is how nice the packaging is. Very Apple like, sleek and simple. But let's not kid ourselves. What we really care about is what's inside the box. So, without further ado, let me dive in and show what's in inside the box, shall we? First, let's look around the box. On the side, you can see the logo and stuff. You can see all the specs. Comes in memory foam, on the go, 2 meter ex piece extension, and detachable microphone. While I figure out how to unbox this thing, I'll post a picture of the specs in the video for this particular headset. You can get this from the HyperX official website. You can pause the video if you want to read it all. It has the exact same spec as Cloud One, but it doesn't come with extra accessories like spare set of Velar ear cushions, volume control, airplane headphone adapter, and the mesh bag. So it's pretty much everything you love about Cloud One, but without extra accessories, and it's like thirty dollars cheaper. If you go on Amazon right now, it's like $79. Personally, in my opinion, I prefer this headset because I don't need all those extra stuffs. I remember moving on. What's included in the box are as follows the manual. This headset works with PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Nice packaging, memory foam. In the box, it also includes the headset itself. This is over the e over the ear headset, by the way. This particular one is black color, but you can get it in gunmetal red or pink color. It also comes with PC extension, which are braided, by the way. And lastly, it comes with a detachable microphone. I think that's pretty much everything that comes in the box. Well, first of all, let me say that this headphone looks sexy. The sound quality on this headset is very good. I have already tested it out. It's a huge step up from my current $20 headset, which I will compare it to later on this video. The build quantity is very good with this braided cable, aluminum plates, and HyperX logo on the side and at the top with premium looks, and aluminum arm to adjust, adjust, adjust the headband, soft cushion, and nice stitching with HyperX logo. Overall, it's pretty nice looking. Have on headset.
On the side there's a microphone plug which you can remove to attach a microphone that came with it. Make sure you don't lose that because like, it's pretty easy to lose. The microphone snap easy like that. Or you can also bend the micro microphone to adjust adjust to your liking. The ear cushion on this is very soft. Overall it's a good looking headset slash headphone. It, it does feel very durable. This is the current headset that I own right now. The brand name is called Head Rush. Um, I bought it from my local tech store for 20 bucks. I have it for like 3 years now. If, it's, if you have seen my previous video, you know that I use it to record my audio with it. Unfortunately, my the microphone is not working and shit, so I'm placing with this new headset. I've been wearing this new headset for a couple hours now, I don't, and I don't feel any stretch. It's very comfortable. The, the microphone is very decent. If you haven't noticed it, I've recorded this whole video with this microphone, so you can be the judge whether it sounds good or not. The thing I love about this headphone headset is that you can easily remove the microphone and use it for on the go so it's automatic turned to headphone on the fly personally I like this feature because if the microphone doesn't work anymore you can always replace it and still use it as a headphone overall I'm happy with my purchase I definitely recommend this headset for anyone that's looking for an affordable gaming headset the only con I have with this particular headset is it doesn't come with a dongle that lets, lets you control the volume but they do offer the option on their cloud one version and up but you gotta pay an extra so yeah that concludes my video i hope you enjoyed the video if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more video like this subscribe and oh and as always thank you for watching i'll see you guys on my next video yeah.